this is William Stem Network, and today we're going to look at Mind Puber. Mind Puber was made by D David Gilday, who teamed up with Mike Dobinson to create Cube Stormer. Cube Stormer's record is two seconds, and this is what Mind Puber does. This, uh, with how it can tell where the the motors are, is that it waits till it can't budge anymore, and then it releases, and. The ultrasonic sensor detects when you put in the put it in the tray, and you have to align the cube tray by yourself using the arrow buttons. And it will say on the display, "Cube Mindcuber Version 1.0" by David Gilday, Mindcuber.com. Enter coin cube. And one of the modifications I made is the piece that was right here. I flipped it up like that, so it would but so it would stop. And I'm now positioning the cube. And the red on will have the corner right here. And put it in like that. And then it will do its scanning. And this is it scanning it. On the display, it's showing. I don't know if you can see it, but it's on the number six, and it has a timer. And now, sometimes it has errors on scanning it, and it will go over and do it again. So we'll wait till it does it again. I'm going to move it like that, over to that corner. Let's move one of 40. And the holder for it, it both holds it, to flip it, and it also holds it to turn it, and this is a lot better than Tilted Twister, because Tilted Twister, it solves it in about 6 minutes, and it takes 45 seconds to figure out a solution, but so this one takes 2 minutes and takes 10 seconds to find out a solution, so it's a lot more reliable, and... Before I couldn't download the program because it was RxC, but then I realized that David on the README tab it tells you how to get that RxC program so you can play with Mindcuber if you have a Rubik's Cube. And as you can see, that part's working. It has about 10 moves left. 10, 15 moves left. And the tilted twister sometimes fails because of its arm. This one rarely fails. So it's a lot, lot better than tilted twister. It has five moves left. Then ten. And so it flashes green saying that solved the Rubik's Cube. And this is William Stem Network. Bye!